Hey everybody, my name is Lay Beat Lane and welcome back to ARK. I am a man with a plan. I have Gary Jr., the beloved son of my first tame that I lost. Tragically. And I'm gonna finish perimetering. I'm gonna finish doing the perimeter of where my, where my base is gonna be. <laughs> so that way I have protection. I can keep my animals safe. I have it all laid out right here. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm gonna make of my world. Oh, wait a minute. What does that mean? Protection? Remember, always use protection. <laughs> oh no. I wanna know what this is, but this little... That was my only arrow! Hey, quit harassing me. That's a, that's a tough little dino. That thing is strong, beefy. Where'd they go? What is this thing? Oh, it's dropping. Oh, y'all ain't gonna come in the water. That looks so fucking stupid. <laughs> it's coming down, but it's going down for real. Apparently, I'm invisible in the water. Well, hello. All right, you're right where I need to be. So this means war. <laughs> Y'all want some? Um, oh, it would be my pleasure to kill you. It would be my honor! You are not gonna get away from me! <laughs> it's only a blueprint, though. How did you get in through my security? It's okay, you're cool. I should be able to make one more that will fit that corner, shouldn't I? I have to go around now. <laughs> whoop de doo Dang, I'm blocking the fish off. It's kind of like a dam. Oh, you're going to be so yummy in my belly when I get y'all. Uh, that looks kind of stupid. But I'm fine with it for now. Now anything that comes over this way, like an alpha raptor for example, will not see me, will not see my house, nothing like that, and won't get any funny ideas. I'm sorry! I pissed that thing off! I'm so fucking sorry! I didn't even do... You need to calm down! You need to take a pill that chills, and chill the pill, and then put it in the freezer, and then it sit for a good day or two, and then after you're done doing that, you can take it out, wrap it in some seaweed, some rice, whatever you like to have with your chill pills, and then swallow it whole and calm down. I wonder what happens over that way. I'm too scared to go back home though, that... Bronto, or whatever it's called, man, it's not happy that I tried to acquire some meat. In fact, it is unhappy with all of my decisions. And it's still not showing me the recipe. That's gonna serve to be a big problem when I need to tame, when I need to make my saddle. Yeah. I still need a larger amount than that. 
can't go home yet until I've eaten and until I'm beaten until I've geeking until I've geeking until I'm bleeding. That thing is so cool looking though. I'm a huge fan. I need to make a sleeping bag and kind of put it out here. I'll be right back. I'm going to turn the game off and back on to see if that helps with my little uh, crafting problem. Oh! That's all I had to click. Okay. Boy, do I feel like a big dumb brain idiot. <laughs> I feel like I'm moving so slow though. <laughs> oh! Please tell me that this guy is not still mad at me. Don't be mad, please. I didn't mean to offend you. Look, I'm even unarmed. I don't have anything in my hands. You don't have to be so mad. See? Friend. Me? Friend. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> me friendly me your best friend no kidding no kidding no kidding you gotta be kidding oh no kidding right I got it! I can ride Gary Jr. I'm gonna finish my perimeter and I'm gonna make this bad boy. And I might make the worst mistake of my playthrough of this yet by doing what I'm about to do. But I'm gonna get on Gary Jr. and I'm gonna take him for a joyride. Right after I ruin this thing's day. Who's your daddy? See now, god damn it. Ooh, that scared the shit out of me, but I'm okay. I am still punching. Yeah! Dennis, why did you let the fire go out? I don't know how safe this actually is, or if I'm doing anything correctly, or if I'm just completely stupid. I might have to take one and put it here too, because there's a little bit of a gap here, so something can kind of like zoop right there. But if I put something there, then it'll drop right on top of it and die like an idiot. Uh, stupid! This looks so basic. You guys are probably enjoying this. And some of you actually are. Uh, y some of you have told me about how this game is kind of like nostalgia for you because it reminds you when you first started playing the game and learning everything and how me being ignorant or my, my lack of knowledge of what to do just kind of reminds you of the good old times. And, and by all means, if that's why you like the series, then I'm happy with that. I'm happy. I'm happy to be playing it now. As old as it is, I'm happy to be learning this stuff. I'm happy to be on the ark. <laughs> That's enough. I have what I need. Okay. Um... Yeah, we're facing the right way. We need to go back home now. Oh... I am about to do this so hard. What is this? Oh, this is cool. It's like a an abandoned. Celadonta utilicero is a friendly herbivore, common to the tundra and grassland regions of the island. It is a large and dangerous creature, though it seems fairly trusting of the fauna around it. Once attacked, Celadonta begins charging towards its foe. It builds up momentum as it charges, and depending on its ultimate impact speed, 
the results can be terrifying. With enough room to charge, it can even skewer the largest creatures in just one gore. Despite how powerful Silodonta are, many tribes still hunt them extensively due to their unique resources. Its horns can ground into a highly arousing powder, and its thick fur can support many insulating outfits, making the Silodonta in high demand. Even less advanced tribes use packs to hunt them down, though at significant peril. When not being hunted for its horns, Silodonta makes an impressive beast of burden. Its ability to take on far larger opponents provided sufficient charging room, as well as its sizable load capacity, make it a solid addition to any trader party or gathering expedition. What's this thing that- that's freaking cool! Huh. Who would have thunk it? I didn't know there was little things in the game like that that you can learn about these things. That's That was cool. And I know there's a bigger story to all this that you kind of have to learn and go through all the worlds and all that to figure out. But that was cool, though. So what is that? Is that like an XP boost or something? I'm probably wasting it right now. And you guys are probably screaming at me through your phone. Look at that! This is probably a major fire hazard, but I'm cooking a lot of meat. Dude, that looks so funny! So that's how I sit back down. Dude, look at that! Look how fast I was able to move! Are you hungry? What am I looking at in that water? You mean to tell me that thing has been in there with me? That is crazy. You can see the drop off where it gets super deep in that water. And I hate every bit of it. Why do they poke their heads above? What is he doing? Is that like a glitch or something? Is he dead? Are you dead, big fishy? No, big fishy not dead. Big fishy very much alive. I don't know exactly how far away that tower is. What is that? That's a Spinosaurus! I think that's a Spino! Oh, that's not a friendly. That's not a friendly. Oh, that's a mean mother right there! That's a mean one! Yes, that's mean! That's cool, I haven't seen one yet though. But getting close to it. That is scary. <laughs> Oh, there's a waterfall over here! I kind of see something out that way. Alright. Let's go home before Curiosity kills the cat. I'm not risking it with Gary Jr. I'm sorry, but I'm not. Does that goddamn shark flying?! Oh, he's not flying. He's just super massive. He's got big balls. Look how big that is! Well guys, there you have it. I got my perimeter entirely up and I finally got a saddle for a Pteranodon, Gary Jr. And I got to ride him around and see some cool stuff. I swear, the more that I play this, the more addicted I get. This is... Well, I'm afraid that's all the time I have for today. Thank you guys so much for sticking around and seeing it through. I loved every second of it. This was a really fun episode to make. 
Uh, if you liked it, leave a like on the video, like, share, and comment. The 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 three the three stooges. And subscribe if you're new to the channel. If you haven't already, join the family. We're really close to 200. 200 subs. We might have hit it by the time this goes up. I don't know. But we're really close to 200. And thank you guys so much for everything that you've been doing for this channel, for me. Uh, commenting, helping me. It means more than you know. It really does. And uh, I guess turn on that notification bell so you never miss an episode of ARC. My name is Labia Lane, and I will see all of you guys in the next ARC video or whatever I upload next. Take it easy.